So this is the application that we are going to be migrating from AngularJS to Angular. And those of you who've been with me for a while will recognize this application as being very, very similar to the application that we built in the Angular JS course, or in my Angular, my original Angular 1 course. Now it's a contact application, so it's basically a way of keeping contacts in a database. So you can search that so Ash should bring up a couple of people, including this person here. We have this kind of card control with details of the person, the sex, the location, like an email, all this stuff is fake generated data and a birthday here. So we can edit a person and hit save. And there we go, we can delete a person. And you can see the top right hand, we've got these toasters that are showing us that letting us know when those asynchronous actions are complete. It's on local host, so actually it's pretty fast, but if you're running this in production and it goes across a network, it might be a lot slower. We can sort and specify the direction of sort, and we can also create a contact uh, here. It's got some validation, and you can provide some, it's a lot of information really here. And then you can hit create, and it'll create ASIM, which should now appear here and with a default avatar. So it's quite a lot going on with this application. There's quite a lot of functionality, at least enough to demonstrate everything that you're going to need to know in order to migrate your application from AngularJS to Angular.